That little light is the moon peeking out of the clouds. That was a big, big squall that collapsed. I saw up to 30 knots and it was pretty out of control. But now the moon's out and I'm basically uh, in the back of the squall. And you can see my world here. That's my foot. <laughs> that's, uh, that's a toilet. The toilet is a bucket, believe it or not. But um, more later. You can see we're only doing 10 knots and about 10 knots of breeze. Uh, Crossy's back sleeping. He had to uh, come and help out when uh, we were under 30 knots of wind and sustains a boat speed of 22 knots. Uh, you know, that's the my world here. You're familiar with it. And, oh, yeah, the bucket. So you can't really see that, but um, I'm about to get hit by another squall. Uh, wind's starting to pick up. And uh, it's raining on me right now. You wonder how we trim the sails at night. We have some uh, fluorescent trip uh, on the on the batten. So actually, if I do this, you can see the battens coming out. Those are the battens, and so I can trim the sails that way. Helps out. Okay, lights out. Now under the moon little kind of R2-D2 looking thing, uh, I'll just light it up. That's uh, that's a dome, that's our SADCOM system, and uh, around it is uh, protection for it, and always something to hang on if it's really blowing, so that's how we're sending uh, videos and communicating. Now some of you have asked uh, how uh, I filmed this. Well. Basically, I use my iPhone, and uh, you can see that I'm steering with one hand, and uh, I guess I'll just, uh, well, change hands, and here we are. So this is my other hand. Okay, I'm back with that hand. It's pretty quiet here. Uh, Krusty's sleeping down below. Uh, next to my foot here is uh, the main winch, and... Uh, Here's uh, my grinder, and basically that winch uh, allows me to trim that sheet over there, which is a spinnaker sheet. It's a big spinnaker, which basically is way too big. Okay, I gotta drive a little more carefully here. I'm filming while I'm driving. Probably not a legal thing to do. There are times where we can use the autopilot. I'm gonna turn it on. There's the auto here. So, look, Ma, no hands. One tiller, two tiller. Ah, uh, <laughs> I don't really trust this thing. But I'm here, I'm ready to grab the tiller. Yeah, and that other little doodad there. It has a stereo, so let's see what's playing. Okay. In the event of something happening to me. Uh-oh. There is something I would like you all to see. Okay, I'll just stop there, right there. Well, that's the thing about music, you know, we kind of all disagree on what kind of music we want to hear. So, uh, maybe it wasn't my best choice. Words were, not, nothing's going to happen. Oh yeah, the bucket. Well, the bucket is a toilet because we don't have running water, so basically, I hate to tell you the details, but... That's what we use, or we go over the lifelines, you know, stick our butts up there. Um, it's part of life on board, and believe me, when it's windy, challenging, so we use the bucket. Here's one, and so I wanted to comment on the, our special bathroom here. It's a perfectly normal uh, bucket. Fill it with ocean water, start of the way, and then do your business. A lot of people ask, so I thought I'd answer. Oh yeah, and the question about privacy? <laughs> when you're double-handed, you always have privacy. The great thing about it, it's the challenge too. So hey, uh, how, to, um, how to stay up at night? Well, uh, no espresso machine, so this is my sunset shot. And I love those. Green tea, and um, I think uh, Krusty's addicted to them now. He thought they were a little bitter at first, but the quiet taste, they're actually really good. And guess what? They're recommended by 
Dr. Well, or somewhere, I saw that somewhere. Almost, well, anyway. Okay, sends a shot. The moon is amazing, so uh, just to finish off, actually right next to the moon is Jupiter. You can't see it there. Just peeking out of the clouds. So we'll look at the water here. I'll just turn my light on. And, uh, so either fluorescent of the water, maybe. Anyway, we're making track. Over it out. <laughs>